Hi, Morgan. Well, uh, Pfizer's been working on multiple approaches to COVID-19. One of them involves screening a compound, uh, a library of compounds that are antivirals, essentially ones that interfere with the virus's ability to replicate. Now they say they've identified a lead compound that they aim to have in human testing by the third quarter. That's several months ahead of schedule. The company also saying that they and partner BioNTech plan to be able to start human trials with their vaccine by the end of this month. And that's the same technology that Moderna is using, that messenger RNA technology that Moderna's already started trials with. They also say they're studying existing drugs like azithromycin, the antibiotic, and their rheumatoid arthritis drug, Zelljans. We talked with Chief Scientific Officer Dr. Michael Dolston earlier about the timelines for a vaccine. Here's what he said. If successful through the clinical studies and approval by regulatory authorities, we are now in our timelines uh, able to project that we could potentially supply millions of vaccine doses by the end of 2020. So this is much faster than the kind of original projection of 18 months, and it's almost half the time. So these new technology guys really speeding up timelines, but you do hear experts saying that 18 months would still be incredibly fast to get a vaccine that's widely available.